Over the years, sign companies and designers have uh, used sign comp extrusions in many unique custom uh, ways. Uh, in this case, there was the need to uh, adapt to round street poles and conceal as much as possible, although still in the end we've got the hose clamps uh, still visible. But what sign comp is able to do uh, with a unique combination of extrusions is to pass through the hose clamp and recess it within to a hollow on the inside, uh, connect it with a, uh, a body so which becomes a gripper onto the round post, but overall it's still working with the media pieces out here so that there's the achievability of working with maybe one or several different components that would apply fasteners and where those would recess within the extrusion cap it off and have a changeable uh, system all within one uh, unit. So let's take a look at all the components that uh, others have done to achieve this. Okay, so quickly we're going to go over uh, here is essentially the piece that we've got attached to the poles. Ultimately it could be achieved with just the one extrusion, the series two uh, square post. But to attach to a radius or a round post, we're going to uh, attach that with the Series 2 bleed body. But more importantly than anything are the attachments that you're going to want to use for the media source uh, within the, uh, the element that we place onto the sign poles. It would be, of course, the advantage of sign comp is the, all the adapters to take care of eighth inch, quarter inch, half inch. Uh, the 2-3 reveal, which essentially can hook to any uh, thick material, and then the copy bars will show. But before we get into all the different media sources that you'll try to achieve within the uh, post attachment here, let's talk about first how this uh, uh, attachment was uh, made. So we've got the Series 2 square post, and the main thing that we want to pay attention to here is the open uh, hollow or void that we've got in the extrusion. This is where everything can be achieved with the fasteners to attach the Series 2, but to also get the, uh, the hose clamp to pass through there, actually bury the uh, adjustment screw inside the void while still having the channel for all the attachments that we'll have left open and free so that you can continue on uh, to achieve any of those that are going to clean up the edges and not show the fasteners for those uh, particular elements. Essentially what we've got again is the, the Series 2 square post with the open hollow in here and you can see the hose clamp passing through. Again the channel here is left open so that we can slide in our uh, adapters or attachments of uh, uh, actually a sign body or a copy bar. On the other end obviously the screw bosses come into uh, work where we can attach and cap off the top and bottom of this. A custom cap could be made to actually cover up the uh, the additional part with the Series 2 hooked onto here so that it can actually grip and grab onto a post now, please forgive the very crude drilling that's happened here. Um, I don't have the proper tools to achieve a nice routered uh, channel for this to kind of go through. But essentially what we've done is gone through and drilled the holes so that we can still achieve getting a screwdriver into here, but yet we've uh, recessed the screw attachment area for the tightening of the hose clamp, all while hiding and concealing the attachment of the Series 2 body to the Series 3 post. That's actually done by drilling an oversized hole here and here where the screw can actually pass through it. And when that passes through, it reaches down into the lower shelf where you can see the, the screw head right there. And then we can get a nut onto the back side. Okay, so in this case we've got a three inch uh, round post and we've got our attachment made up here. And what we would do is slide over the top of this uh, post, extend the clamps out, and then attach and tighten these with a 
regular screwdriver. So essentially what we've got, you can see, is this, and I'll go ahead and uh, tighten this up. But of course now it's going to have the, the sign comp channel in it that will accept any of the adapters or the 2-3 reveal. Okay, so now we've gone ahead and tightened these uh, screws. And as you can see, they're still within the void of the extrusion here. A nice clean, if there can be such a thing as a cleaner look with the addition of the hose clamps. But again, this is fully secure onto that post now. You could even drive some additional screws if uh, wanted to help with some of the flex that may come from the force of the winds for the sign to still help stabilize this to the post beyond the hose clamps. But the main thing here again is the channel that will adapt to any of the adapters for the media source that we would uh, carry within these. Okay, again the real area where sign comp excels uh, is because we've got this series 2 post that has the standard series 234 channel with inside it. Now it works with the 8th inch adapter. Um, the advantage to these is certainly you put the fasteners on when it slides down into the post. You will no longer see those fasteners. There is the 8th inch for 8th inch material. Half inch for half inch material. All operating the same way with the fasteners to slide down into the post. Uh, many of you probably haven't used or maybe had the chance to use the copy bar. Great uh, system here where we actually take and there's a screw bus into it and this slides into the post if we can see that from another angle. To attach that on and then that attaches actually with a set screw into here to that screw bus so it's perfectly attached. But one of the most unique things is the uh, Series 2-3 reveal because this can have anything attached to it with the fasteners coming through the back side. As we'll show with the, here's a Series 2-3 reveal and then we would hook that to the side of this body resulting with fasteners attached here that will slide down into the post and no longer be visible. One of the very unique things with the Series 2-3 post in this application for street signs are the possible use of hanging banners by drilling a hole and passing through with a 5 8 threaded bolt. But the locking point on the inside is a 3 quarter inch nut that is perfectly locked in so that when you tighten you've got this totally secured for a pretty heavyweight uh, extension of a banner system to go out and uh, conceal things. And there's also the attachment of a, a nice uh, addition here is the bevel frame which accepts 8th inch material as well to give you a paddle sign that would look like this. But again the fasteners onto the back side to in many ways what we're trying to accomplish is a system that will allow us, there we've got the uh, bevel frame, maybe it becomes a stackable type system and here we've got the copy bar. I would highly suggest with any of these more heavyweight signs we would always recommend certainly uh, engineering that correctly for the weight and force that's going with on this pole, but the series 2-3 Reveal can actually accept on top of that a thick body, uh, maybe because this is illuminated with LEDs, whatever the purpose may be, but uh, that's the unique being of this, uh, this system that we've, uh, we've got here. But of course, again, getting back to maybe one and more significant would be the Series 2-3 Reveal is I'll actually add that in here as a little spacer inside to use the banner reveal into this so that you've got again an extended banner off here 
uh, with a system where it, it, it locks in the bolts on the inside. If we look at that again, again, what's happening there is you've got a 5 8 inch bolt passing through there, and the 3 quarter inch nut is perfectly locked into the channel of the, the reveal. So a very, very modular system for all the different types of uh, media that you may use within this. As we get to show maybe something more to scale, here's a piece of the phenolic materials, half inch locked in without any fasteners vi visible with on the outside. And again, maybe the unique thing here is that it's got a dual message a little spacer with the Series 2-3 reveal. Another paddle sign over the top of that. So there you have it. Uh, the many different unique ways of using our Series 2 post in a custom fashion to attach to street posts. Uh, the stainless steel uh, hose clamps would of course be something that you would purchase at your local hardware store for the correct size post whether it be 2 inch, 3 inch, 4 inch. Uh, we do actually have a thicker post when you get up to those more massive size uh, posts. Maybe you want to extend to the Series 3 rectangular which has the same hollow with inside it to conceal what all the same things we've done here and even a Series 3 or 4 bleed body that can attach to that post so it becomes the kind of gripper that helps hold it on to a round post. So thanks. We hope you enjoyed uh, this unique custom application and find some use of our post adapters uh, along with that.